meteorologist Ashley Ruiz. Good morning and happy Friday to you. We are heading into Mardi Gras weekend, one of the best times of year, and it is 617. We are waking up to temperatures in the 30s and 40s all across southeast Louisiana. New roads 37, Baton Rouge 37 as well, 35 for a cool spot in Kentwood. Now the winds are still whipping out of the north between 10 and 15 miles per hour right now, so it feels much colder than it is out there. 20s and 30s, so you will want to layer up, send the kids with the hats, the gloves. Gloves, scarves, anything of that nature, and with socks and boots or, or tennis shoes. And be sure to stay warm today. Temperatures are going to struggle despite us clearing out, high pressure settling into the area, and we'll warm up, but we will slowly warm up into the low and mid 50s. So most of the day will be spent in the lower 50s, and it's going to feel a few degrees cooler, but the wind will begin to relax later on this afternoon and this evening. But notice how quickly the temperatures will drop into the evening hours, which I'll get to in a sec. But if you're wondering, uh, should you pack the rain gear for any uh, weekend festivities, whether you're going to New Orleans or you're staying here in the capital city, we won't have to worry about any rain until late Sunday night, I'm saying overnight, while most of us are asleep, or uh, into Monday. Monday morning through at least Monday evening, our next system will move in. Not anticipating any severe weather with this one, but a lot could change between now and then. So we'll be sure to keep you posted, but just just so you're aware and you're not caught off guard if you are going to New Orleans for Lune de Gras, we'll see some wet commutes on Monday and some wet parades, most likely. The rain uh, amounts are looking to be quite manageable. But either way, we'll keep you posted. But Monday through Monday evening, that is the current timing. As for New Orleans, pretty similar as well. Friday, uh, uh, today, it's going to be sunny and beautiful, low to mid-50s. And then if you are going to the parade route tonight for the crew of South Downs, dress warm. Temperatures are going to fall into the 40s. Of course, that rolls at 7. And then around 10 o'clock or so, we'll be in the upper 30s. If you're going to the box for the LSU game against Indiana, same goes. You'll want to bring the blanket because it is going to be quite chilly. Overnight temperatures are going to fall into the upper 20s for southwest Mississippi and lower 30s across South. East Louisiana, at least our neck of the woods, around 32, right on the dot for Baton Rouge. So that is why the National Weather Service went ahead and issued this freeze warning. So a light freeze will drop at or below freezing for several hours for these areas in purple, uh, starting at midnight tonight all the way through Saturday morning. So be sure to protect your plants. Bring them in. If you can't bring them in, just put a light sheet over them. And don't forget about your fur babies. Please bring them in. They absolutely have to be outdoors. Give them plenty of warm and dry shelter. As for the Spanish Town Parade, it is looking perfect. Plenty of sun. If you're going out early, it's going to be chilly, of course. It's going to be chilly throughout the day. Temperatures will warm into the upper 50s by the afternoon. But overall, still going to be a cool day. And we stay rain-free. Sunday, we have several area parades. Of course, one is in Port Allen. That is at 1 p.m. on Sunday. That rolls at 1 p.m. 65. We, we're dry. And then the crew of Camogo, that is 7 p.m. in, in Plaquemine. Around 60 degrees, may see a sprinkle. Not looking likely. As for New Orleans, same goes. Around 65, 10% on Sunday, 40% on Lundi Gras. And then we're pretty much dry on on Mardi Gras. So no issues there really, mainly in the morning. Ash Wednesday, 59 degrees, and then Thursday, 55 degrees. We're going to cool down once again. Let's get a check on